hi there welcome back to my channel where I sim the date is 13th of August 2019 and it is the second time I'm playing um, on camera because I do have time this week to do this so yes today we're gonna be spending a day with the Foreman family who in my rotation they are the first family that I played and I'm not going to be too strict with my rotations so I'll just swap between who I want whenever I want but I'm going to try and do a week each so with the Waters family who I just played in my last video I've played them for a week so I'm gonna go back to this family now I was checking before I started recording um, about what had changed before I came back and well they're a bit more in debt which is to be expected and they had bought some stuff while I wasn't playing them so I just had to look through what they bought and I realized that um, they have some fish that were born in captivity so they start off with one which Lashayla caught and all these fish were born in captivity so I thought that was interesting but yes, let's have a look at who's in this family. So we have T um, Tiana Foreman. These are her traits. We have Lashayla Foreman. Her traits over here. And then we have Katira J. Funk. And if you're wondering why he has a different last name, it's because Tiana was married once upon a time. The uh, marriage didn't last very long because she had a midlife crisis and things went astray. But Katira's father is Mr. Funk over here. So let me just give you a little look at the house. Okay, let me zoom out a bit so you can see where they live. Okay, so this is their house. It's very dark, so you can't really see. But this is the house that I built. <laughs> As you can probably tell. <laughs> um, I mean, I like it. Once again, I've never thought of myself as the best builder. So I'm happy with this. And yeah, as I mentioned in my last video, my time goes very slowly so we will not be spending the whole day with them but i think we'll enjoy the time that we do spend okay i'm just gonna speed up a bit so the agenda for today and uh, i don't know if he's glitching out over there but if you didn't see that the agenda for today is it is halloween and i can't remember if tiana will have the day off but if she doesn't she's gonna call and fake sick because otherwise she's going to disappear in the rabbit hole later. And Shayla's going to school and she'll disappear. And then Katira will just be with the babysitter. And that would be very interesting. Yep, yeah, it's Halloween. So, um, Tiana needs to do some food shopping. So we'll probably go down to the grocery store. Do some shopping. And just sort things out around the house what needs to be sorted i've already got some things queued up see i'll skip to the part where they're waking up because this might take a while okay i'm back and they're up now i had a bit of a problem so I've edited that bit out, but um, yeah, just sorting things out since I come back to this family. Some things that have gone a bit strange. Yeah, for some reason, um, I tried to feed him, but when I clicked on the chair I only had this option and I thought it's because they didn't have a blender 
but I bought a blender and it still didn't work so I just cheated his hunger <laughs> up till I figure out what's going on the shale is awake and off camera I also added the new daycare woman so instead of uh, Tiana having to take Katira with her which goes shopping which is well it can be a bit inconvenient he's gonna go to daycare so you'll get a look at how that works but yes there was a lot of mess in this house when I swapped back to them but I'm just glad they don't have a washing machine because there'd be dirty clothes everywhere And Katira isn't potty trained yet. So we're gonna work towards that a bit more. Oh, if it's gonna have the same problem. Let me just. Yeah, so one of the problems I had sw um, switching back was that all the baby things they had no interactions on them so I had to reset them for the interactions to show up pick up and as you can see I'm making an effort to speak much slower so if there's a lot of pauses it's because I'm just trying to pace myself okay picked up page up and yeah I've been messing with a bit of my settings so some of them aren't as low as they should be for recording. Yeah, this works. So if there's any jerkiness, I apologise for that. What are you complaining about? So, um, yeah, when I first started this town, I wasn't actually playing with um, Tiana and Lishayla. I had another family that their family line, I basically had been playing their family for, oh, since I, I don't know, maybe since 2011, but long story short, they glitched and I could have fixed it or gone back but I thought no let me just play someone else so I deleted them from the world and played with I uh, stopped with this family so it was just Tiana and the Shayla and they were living in a you know small apartment above a shop and then Tiana got a boyfriend and she got pregnant by accident and um, that's why Katira is here. Okay, let me just show you quickly where they're living. Right, so. Their house is right here. The Waters family, who I was playing earlier, um, lives here. And the other family I played in this rotation was the Malcolm family who live here. And I was thinking about playing the Rock family who live here, although they used to live over here, they just moved. But I feel like I'm just gonna take it easy for the moment. There's no rush. Okay, school. So Lashayla should be going to school. She's gonna go into the rabbit hole. Ah, and Katira's father, he lives in this apartment over here. So I'm thinking of a way to do um, like joint custody see how that works but um, I'm not quite sure yet it might have to happen when he's a child all right let things load up again oh. 
Okay, it's not enough space for that. Go and move out of the way. Ah, oh, I'm sorry for pausing so much. Just have it to pause when it's okay. Okay, first of all, Missy over here is going to get change. She's going to do some housework and then we're going to go grocery shopping. So yeah, a lot of dirty things that we need to clean up. She'll do that and then she'll go downstairs. Let's see, what is there downstairs to clean? I've also, um, I've got it disabled for children to wash dishes because when my toddlers grow to children, they start, I think, five years old. So I thought, five years old, you should not be washing dishes. So I just disabled, um, disabled it for the whole child age. So that's why Shaylee didn't wash her dishes before she went to school. What is she doing? You should be... Make silly face to who? Ah, uh, I think the bin inside needs emptying. That's why she's gonna go outside. Mirage. Okay, yeah, you should be going to school. Probably should have showed you the outside of the house while it was light outside. Come on. Yeah, and the rain is probably not helping with lag. Any counters need cleaning? All right, and I've uh, changed my mouse as well, so clicking is a bit clunky. Yeah, um, okay. Clean the Shayla's room a bit. Oh no, she's too upset to clean. <laughs> yeah, she's too stressed to clean. Okay. Go do with your son. Let's see. Where's all the interactions? All right, and I need to not forget to uh, call in sick if she doesn't have a day off. I feel like she will have to go to work, so we'll call in sick. Then we'll go to grocery shop. Right, I think we have to wait an hour before to be able to call in sick. Maybe. Maybe she's not available. Ah, oh, she's going to be too upset to buy food too. I might just <laughs> cheat this up just that she can buy food. Yeah, hopefully that's all right. Okay, let's go grocery shopping. Just a reference. Um, Tiana is 36. Or, well, really 35 because um, the tagger shows the age one year older than it really is. Kitira is only two. And the Shayla is nine years old. Okay, 
grocery store. Let it load up. The grocery store is right here. You can see. Let it load. And I mean, it's nothing special. <laughs> oh, but it works. Okay. As you can see, I'm using the Savia Seller mod to run this as well. And then I have got a. I mean, it says um, food register, however, it's actually the general store register. Oh, that's loud. Hope it's not too loud for you guys. The train going past. Yeah, general store, but you can't actually buy from the general store in the home world, so it's unfortunate. And then after this, depending on what time she finishes shopping, um, Sean Malcolm is normally at the market starting from 10 or 11. So we'll probably go down with there and buy some fish. All right. Don't have much money, but needs food. So let's just buy some ingredients. remember what she has and what she doesn't have hmm. ah she actually needs some bottles too so we'll have to buy all of them Peanut butter. Did someone just say hi to her? Let's see who was that. Oh, Sasha Malcolm. Phantom Rock, okay. Let's get some eggs. Some cheese. I think I've got pretty much every bit of custom food that I have in this shop. Else. Oh. oh no, I don't know if you guys can see that. She has fleas because her dog has fleas. That is disgusting. Okay, what else? Rice. Mm. And you know what? That will probably be enough. Something that's not too expensive. Okay. Mutual pay. Who else is here? Mari Davis. Now she's actually really good friends with Amari, so she must have a little chat with him. Mm, up to that day. Yeah, 
Yes, he's at the daycare. Oof. Sorry, let me just move it. So the train is not too loud. Ooh, Alton Rock. Okay, Sean Markham's not at the market yet. Thinking, what should she do next? Okay, whoa, bakery. Let's yeah, let her visit the bakery. Okay. Whoops, the wrong thing. We get a tax again, which is more money that she does not have to spend. And apart from the bakery, I did actually build a flower shop as well, which is just over there somewhere. Okay, let's just let this load a bit. Yeah, I built a flower shop too, so I need to figure out who's going to um, tend that one. But because in, in my rotations, I'm also connecting three other worlds. So the other world is St. Clair's. So um, at the moment, the St. Clair's world is not connected to this. I'm waiting until one of my teens grows up um, because then I'll connect it when he's ready to go to university. See, I'm thinking maybe his sister would run the flower shop. I mean, there's really no rush. Yeah, she's gonna ring that doorbell. And if somebody was living here, I'm guessing she would go inside and use the bell that's inside. Um, but since there's no one there, I would have to manually open this. But to be honest, I just want her to buy something from him. So let's just buy some jam, whatever's available. Isn't he not meant to be in school? Oh, what's going on today? Yeah, see what's on offer. I had Chola Waters make some extra food before I left her family. <laughs> okay, so let's see. Apple pie. Yes, yeah, some I've put in cans and some just out there to eat straight away. Jam, marmalade, bread. Okay, let's um, pick some apple pie. Wow, look at that price increase. And let's take, okay, we'll take both. Maybe some marmalade too oh some bread okay let's not not overdo it you can come back another day and she'll say that even though she got it fine okay she's taking herself home 
yeah, my teens are just hanging around. They'll sort that later. Like when I want to record, then everything goes weird. Okay. So let's go to the daycare and I'll show you how it looks. So this is the daycare. I feel like those windows have not rendered, but I can't wait forever them, for them to do that. As you can see, it's um, kind of like a converted warehouse, let's say. So the mailbox is right here. And then the entrance to get in is here. All right, so. If you've seen my tumblr you know how it used to look before it did not look like this <laughs> this is uh, slightly better so you come in through the entrance it's got open sign and yeah toilets little place for them to sleep and upstairs are the apartments so there's two rooms and there's only one lady living here at the moment and then kitchen living room space toilet so yes so i'm not sure where the woman is now oh there she is okay oh that's good she's actually doing her job so i just went to create a sim and i got um a pre-med man convert him to a woman just so i had some interesting kind of uh like slider dynamics i did not edit her apart from that i just put random hair on some random clothes yeah so this is the daycare oh so that's katero home because his mum's home yeah that's fine just because she was holding him when he got teleported out where did he go okay there he is you uncle babysitter service will be over soon to take care of Katero J what I never saw that before. Where's she going? <laughs> right, now that she's home, she's gonna put food away. And we're going to try and do some of that cleaning. Oh no. Uh oh. I completely forgot about that. Let's see. Can she call in sick? Jobs. Call in fake sick. Yep. Sorry work. And she'll still get paid. So that's good. Just going to all this stuff in there oh yeah charlie rutherford is her boss okay um and she can just put that down one of them can go in the fridge but it's pretty much lunch time so yeah let's see how much she can get done what she needs to eat. Wow. This lag. Okay, I'm going to stop mentioning it because it's not a big deal. Okay, so it's upstairs. Let's see clean toilet clean the sink and the baby will 
amuse himself. And here's a medicine cabinet with, oh, I can't remember what's inside it. I think it, um, it's called like Trimacim or something. And it means that when they take it, their energy goes up, but the hunger goes down. So for those times you don't sleep at night, but then you've got to make sure that you are not too hungry or you'll die. Why are you crying? I know you have food in your... Oh yeah, room to feed the fish. Oh, clean. I didn't know they could do that. I've never actually used one of those big fish tanks before. It's a shame we didn't get to stay at the bakery. Bakery, I keep doing that. Um, stay at the daycare for longer. Because I think Katero's half-brother was there. Too cool to see him. Just take a look at family tree. So his mum, his dad, his half brother, and he, his mum is Emmy Reese, and Emmy Reese is pregnant by Charlie Rutherford, who's uh, Tiana's boss, and um, yeah, I'm just happy that the family tree is, you know, it's doing its thing. I like big family trees. Almost midday. Yeah, I like watching my Sims do just, you know, domestic chores, housework, whatever. Do that afterwards. Tiana had to take out a loan for this house, by the way. So the loan was, I think it started at 30,000 or maybe 32,000, and interest has just, you know, racketed, racketed it up. when I first stopped at um, the Malcolm family after paying this one, I looked back the next day and she was about like £300 in debt, like from her actual family funds, rather than this bank mod. But uh, she managed to put it together. And my sister watched my last video because she said she was interested to see it and she said oh why are you error trapping she said i should put some music behind because people might be uncomfortable um feel uncomfortable when i don't speak let's put the radio on Ooh. See if I can find the song I like. Oh, I like this one. We'll just put it on low. Follow himself, alright. Oh, I can't hear up here. intrude on her privacy hmm. 
I'm sure in the vanilla game, midlife crises are maybe like seven days. But I think because I extended my age range, which I haven't mentioned yet. Um, yeah. My sims live a long time. So I think that's why it's much higher. I don't think we're going to get to go to the market today to see Sean, is that his name? Yeah, Sean Malcolm. Buy the fish, that's alright. Someone else can do it. I'm always curious if other people listen to the station, the radio station. <coughs> and which one is their favourite? I think I do like the pop station. I used to like the soul station the most. I feel like there's about three songs that I could just listen to over and over again. So that's the only reason I listen to the pop. Oh, kick you wish but yeah I feel like even though we've not spent the whole day here we've done quite a bit got to the shopping seen the daycare looked at the bakery again so maybe I don't know a good place to end you know or oh, the song has just ended so maybe that's a good place to end so yes this was the four men family just a little bit about you know just a day in their life or a couple hours in their life I think there's some other families that I want to see if I want to play them so I'll probably only play this family for one day and then go maybe play the rock family um, or see if there's anyone else I want to set up the flower market but yeah and then yeah I'm thinking too far ahead but yes this was the Foreman family Oi, wrong button and I hope you enjoyed what you saw about them even if it wasn't much but thank you for watching this video and I will see you in my next one. Bye!